Howdy everybody, it's the Soda Jerk with the SodaJerk.net with another soda review. Today's soda review is Stuck in the Cup Holder and Mountain Dew Baja Laguna Lemonade. Look at that, we got two new Baja flavors this summer and Laguna Lemonade is one of them. It's due with a blast of natural and artificial mango lemonade flavor. Haven't done one in the old Kroger parking lot in a while, but here we are. On this bottle, we have a parrot with a nose ring. I don't know if a parrot can have a nose ring. I guess it's a beak ring in this case. That's a cool looking parrot. And on the other side, a starfish with a snorkel, I'm assuming. Is that a clam? Well, we get some more of a wave. Anyway, you got a, you got a, uh, you got the starfish, you got the parrot, you got the twentieth anniversary, twentieth Baja anniversary. As you know, all you got to do is put the word that's celebrating its anniversary in front of the word anniversary, and uh, the idea comes across. This contains zero percent juice. Again, found this in a Kroger. It's a giant store in general, so if you have a Kroger or Kroger-related store in your area, maybe it's there. Ingredients. Carbonated water, high fructose corn syrup, natural and artificial flavor, citric acid, sodium benzoate, preserves freshness, caffeine, sodium citrate, gum arabic, calcium disodium EDTA, to protect flavor. Yellow number six. Follow the authority of Public Incorporated, Perks, New York, 10567. Um, you can scan this label if you just want to do that. Wouldn't that be weird if someone's just like, I wait for the soda jerk to show me QR codes on bottles so I can scan them without having to do it myself? Um, apparently, there's some sort of rule. There's a game happening right now. Man, I'm so behind on the Mountain Dew stuff at the moment. Oh, collect coins for a chance to get Baja gear. Maybe I'll try that. How much sugar's in this? 80, no, 73 grams. How much caffeine's in this? 91 milligrams in this 20 ounce bottle. It's a nice amber, no, it's kind of a, I was gonna say dehydrated yellow, but that's really gross. It's a very mango, orangey yellow color. Drink more fluids. Smells really good though. Smells like limo. Limo? Smells like mango. Smells like lemonade. Mangonade. That second sniff was a bit stronger on the on the lemony citrusy scent. There's definitely a punch. There's definitely a, definitely a, a stabbing of the nostrils. It smells good though. Not overly sweet. Well, that mango is way stronger than I thought it was going to be. It is mango first, and then lemonade. That's a that's a hearty mango taste. It's a sharpness to it too. Hits the back of the throat, a little bit of tart, a little bit of sharp. But you know it's a Mountain Dew, so it's sweet. But it's not sugary nonsense. It is the aftertaste. Honestly, say feels sweeter than the the sip itself. Um, now that the mouth has been coated with Laguna Lemonade, uh, my mouth is sweet at the moment. But my mouth is always sweet. That's also kind of gross. Anyway, the flavors definitely permeate the cheeks. They, the, lemon, the lemonade takes a back seat to the mango. This is, like I said, mango first. I'm, I'm searching for the lemonade. Maybe that's a little bit of bitterness I'm getting. But overall, it's a good beverage. It's not overly complex. Um, you know what you're getting. If you like mangoes, you'll probably like this beverage. Um, Pepsi Mango, which is a great mango cola. Um, if you like that, you probably like this, although, you know, not a cola. But the lemonade, don't, don't expect a lot of lemonade taste when you drink this, though. Because that's, it's there. Maybe, you know what the lemonade's probably doing? It's probably making it a bit more refreshing. It's probably lightening it up a bit. It's just harder to tell since the mango is so prevalent. 
but I've had about I've had about half of it now. Not even trying. Um, and I will save this for you know my lunch. Today's lunch: turkey, cheese, dill pickle, mustard, mayonnaise on wheat bread with some Doritos because that's the kind of chips we had at the moment. Nothing wrong with a blue bag of Doritos. If you like a blue bag of Doritos, good for you. If you like soda reviews, head on over to sodajerk.net. Number 1,000 soda reviews. I think this for me personally is 892. That's a lot of sodas. Anyway, the sodajerk.net is your one-stop shop for pop reviews. That's right, it is. You just go there and you stop. And you look nowhere else. You, you trust my opinion and only my opinion. Yeah? Sodajerk.net. I haven't tried them all yet. Thank <laughs> you.